<laughs> yeah, what's called the detective shield, Einstein? As in tonight's breaking news, federal agents make asses of themselves, jumping two homicide cops. No. That was you, Lieutenant. Sorry about the wait. Do you mind telling us what the hell's going on now? Sure. You might have just compromised the terrorism investigation. What the hell is this, a terrorism investigation? They won't tell us anything else. Now, why would they? You were breaking through a padlock door without a warrant. They were looking for suicide bombers. What, Al Qaeda's recruiting 10 year old girls now? It could be our crime scene. The room is set up to hold young girls. They could have brought Rosie there after Bennett's apartment. Yeah, we don't have a clear TOD, so they might have held her there for a few days before they killed her. We've got to get in there. Have CSU check it. Not tonight. The area belongs to the feds now. We'll be briefed at 7.30 a.m. by the Joint Terrorism Task Force. Don't be late. There's a T-shirt on the bed. It's pink with lettering on it. What if it was hers? Don't go near this building until then. Jack. Hello? Hey, Ray. It's Lyndon. Uh, I'm gonna need you to email me some of the files from the Larson case. Okay. I have some of them, but I'm gonna need the rest. When? I'll be working on them tonight. Which ones? All of them. Now? Yeah, right now. Uh, no, it's all right. Oak's already okay. Okay. Thanks. I didn't expect you to be there on a Sunday. I came to help Rick finish the filing. We've really gotten behind. I'm doing all the wedding planning alone. Can I help you? Can I speak to him, please? Uh, he's on a call right now. Can I take a message? Um, please tell him that I really need to speak to him. Sure, sir. I'll let him know you want. Let me guess. He kind of knows you don't really want to go. Don't touch it. Get your shoes on. I'm not dressed, Dad. What was that, Duncan? Well, no, tell him we can't do it until Friday. No, I've given out too many discounts. Well, where the hell is Pete? Hey, I told you to leave it. If you guys are done eating, get to rest. We're gonna be late. No, don't do anything. No, I'll deal with it. I got another call. Hello? Hey, Terry. No, don't, no, don't worry about it. We, we'll figure something out. No, you've done enough already. We, we, we'll figure it out, okay? Yeah, no, all right, no problem. Okay, bye. Where were you last night? 
I really needed some groceries, so I went to the market. Kids are getting dressed. Terry called. She got hung up, so I'm gonna bring them to school, but I gotta move. I'll, I'll take them. attended by Bennett Ahmed, the prime suspect in the Rosie Larson case. This has led to speculation that there may be a connection between the cases. Question, why was Cicero overthrown? If I'd known there'd been a quiz, I would've done what I did in college, skip class. You failed to foresee an alliance between Mark Antony and Caesar's heir, Octavian. Arrogance, Adams will flame out if we stay focused and play this right. We're gonna use a two-pronged approach. First, the All-Stars program. It's finished? No. Not without a fight, Jamie. In addition to boning up on my Cicero, I did some legal research last night. Hunt versus Washington State Apple Advertising, 1977. An organization has standing to challenge any government action injurious to the organization itself. We're gonna file a temporary restraining order for an injunction against the freezing of the All-Star funds. The press is gonna eat this up. You and Adam's going head to head in the courts over an after-school program. Exactly, I already called the lawyers, they're all over it. Which brings me to prong number two. We go on the offensive, the attack, a new ad buy. Borrow money from my parents if I have to. We hit Adams hard. The ad man Cuso ran in 02. And you're the one linking Adams to the slush fund scandal. Let's revive that and anything else that's still relevant. Adams wants to play dirty. I best like the taste of mud. It's not gonna be enough. You seen the news? They're linking Bennett Ahmed to the terrorists of the mosque, which means they're linking you to the terrorists. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I love that you're ready to go negative. But you go for the king? You gotta cut off his head. Ideas? That's what PIs are for. See what he can dig up. So on it. But Jamie, no personal attacks. We go after policy, not character. All right. What are you doing? This is my office. Your lieutenant gave us access. Did he your case file on the Larson girl? Anything else you got? It'd be great if you could hand it over. No, it looks like you got it all. Sarah? What the hell is this? I got a pack of feds up my ass. A mayoral candidate breathing down my neck, and this is the way you run your investigation? Maybe the, the feds leaked it. Well, why would they? They could have jeopardized their own investigation. I don't need to remind you that there's been, what, two, three leaks already in this case? I know, it, it, it's unacceptable. I will find it, I'll plug it up. Well, who else has access to the phone? Only the text, me and Holder. Right, the text could have shared with anybody, every uni, secretary walking in and out of here. The bunchers would have paid a pretty penny for those. I hope the son of a bitch is enjoying it. I'm sure he is. All right, let's go. Hey, I've been, um, I've been meaning to ask you, how did Holzer transfer to silly homicide from county? There's a mark. There's a muckly muck from county covered in his ship. Why? You don't want to know if you were stuck with him, right? Hmm. Lieutenant, we're ready to start. <sighs> the festivities begin. What's up, Linda? I'm the Seattle's Tales detective. You're married yet? How's your blackjack game? Any more payouts yet? Just the primary in the case. Sorry.
Suspect Muhammad H. has made multiple border crossings over the past six months. One trip to Somalia in the same time period. Now, we suspect he may be providing material support for known radical elements connected to the Green Lake Mosque. Detective, how are you tipped off about the meat store location? We were asking questions at the mosque relating to our investigation and got an anonymous note. You're saying that uh, Muhammad was connected to that room? Appears to be. What does it have to do with terrorist activity? We found some suspicious materials in that room, maps of border areas, falsified passports with his photo, and those of multiple young females. The alias is linked up to some of the border crossings and a female companion he was traveling with. These are Caucasian girls? Not usually, no. What about the Larson girl? You get the sense she was being influenced in that direction. In what direction? Terrorism activity. <laughs> Absolutely not. Whatever link my victim has to your investigation is purely coincidental. We can't rule out the possibility, though. Right. When can I get my case files back? Did your investigation surface any contact between Rosie Larson and our suspect? You have my case files. If there was, you'll find it there. What's his last name, your suspect? Unfortunately, the information's still at a high security clearance level right now. We can't afford any more aspects of this investigation being compromised. Sorry for any problems I may have caused. You said one more. That's if I pass the level. You've been on it for an hour. Come on, boys. Get in. Let's go. It's gonna be late. Bottom, hit the ice. I tried that. It's pretty high. It's pretty high. Do you want to try to handle the ice? Yeah. I can go as long as I want. I haven't even got a turn yet. So? I'm going to tell Mara. Okay, I'll be right back. Just be quiet. Florida, man. Florida, man. Dad mad? What? At breakfast. Because you broke a bowl, dumbass. No, he was mad before, when he was making lunch. I wasn't there, so what? Did we do something wrong? No, just shut up. I'm trying to concentrate. Oh, yeah, 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 this guy, he's, he's a real bloodhound. He's, um, he's doing some vetting right now, you know, just, just checking resources, but uh, he's got something good. It's real good. <laughs> you don't have shit. No, but we will. Come on. Nobody's squeaky, Tom. Uh -huh. All we need is a little more dough to mount an offense to. You game? What do you say? You want dirt on Adams? I got something that'll bury that old prick once and for all. If you have something, why haven't you used it already? 
Even I have scruples. Yo, Linda. Hey, where are you headed? Nowhere. What they say? Nothing. Nothing? You went there for like an hour. What the hell's your problem? Why don't you make yourself useful and stay here and do nothing? Mrs. Larson, let me explain. How could you let him do that? It shouldn't have happened, I know. I'm sorry. Let's just go inside. How could you let them have those pictures of her like it was nothing? Just something on TV, just... Everybody could see her like that. Everybody could see my baby girl like that. And he's still out there. You still haven't arrested him. You've done nothing. Look, it is clearly part of the case law. All right, I see. Yeah, thanks, Cal. Keep me informed. Seems that the judge does not think we have standing to file the TRO, which made no sense until I heard the judge was Jack Hollander, one of Adam's old fraternity brothers from UW. Al's filing to recuse, see if we can get a different judge. Mm -hmm. Well, I pulled the stills from the Mancuso campaign and then some from the 98 campaign. There's, um, there's some pretty inflammatory stuff in here. Are you sure you still want to go this way? No, I wouldn't. Because in the beginning, you said you, you didn't want to go negative. In the beginning, I wasn't having my ass handed to me. You might want to sit down, because this is going to floor you. In fact, why don't you lie down? We can't use this. Are you kidding? We have no choice but to use this. Darren, it can't be proven. And even if it could, how is that relevant to winning? To the issues. Let me think about it. Detective Cutter, City PD liaison. You have uh, evidence here recovered from a 106 R Renton Avenue South. Yeah, I was just about to take it to lockup. Why? It's a good thing I caught you. We have some duplicate bag numbers on the evidence list, so you're gonna have to take a look. Can't. I've already signed off on all these, so it's my ass. I, I don't need to touch it. Just look at it. It'll only take a second. No way. Is it Cutter? I'm gonna go talk to my CO. Right here. You're home early. Myers told me not to come in. Then where were you? Just uh gotta get away for a bit. Well, maybe it's for the best. Maybe you just stay home for a little while. How can you say that? The police called here again. So what? They were asking about Muhammad. Why can't you talk to them? Why won't you let them talk to Muhammad? You think I'm guilty, too? Of course I don't. Why would you even think that? I didn't even... Mrs. Larson? I don't want to hear any more of your apologies. Would you please just go away? I need to know if this was Rosie's. I 
I understand your anger right now, but you need to look at this photo. You hurt yourself like that? <laughs> she was in ninth grade, and art science was her favorite class. And the textbook had all these pictures in it. And she said she'd never seen anything so beautiful. And all those swirls of color, she said. <laughs> So, we took it the following year. I thought she'd lost it. You're sure that this was hers, Mrs. Larson? I was that teacher, wasn't I? You'll be the first to know, I promise you. He's still living his life. He's happy. It's... It's not right. You gotta at least give us the shirt. We need it processed by the lab. Hair, fluids, everything. Then we bring in Bennett. Sit down. What? Just sit down. It's over, Sarah. Let it go. I did what I could, but uh, federal case takes priority. Didn't help that little stunt you pulled at the staging area. So, that's it. Your mother ID'd the shirt. It's Rosie's. So what? The idea is useless in court. You could have jeopardized her whole case. Rosie Larson has nothing to do with their investigation, and you know it. Do I? Why are you so sure that this doesn't involve terrorism? Now, if you've got a crystal ball hidden somewhere, I'd suggest you employ it and use it to find evidence we can actually use. You need to talk to the feds. Help us get access. And that's not all. Now, you were supposed to train Holder. But you treat him like a lap dog. What's going on? I have some concerns about his ability to be an effective investigator. Maybe it's time to think about wrapping up here, sir. Head to California. You freeze, Rick. Not as your age, Star Wars is my favorite movie. The second one, Empire Strikes Back. No, Attack of the Clones. Okay, that is not the second movie. Empire Strikes Back is the second movie. Mm -mm. <laughs> yeah, I remember when Darth Vader said, I am your father. <sighs> okay, I was there, so no more than second movie crap. Can I have another cheese sandwich? No. You ruin your appetite for dinner. Why don't you guys go play? Both of you. Come on. Hey, Stan. Is everything all right? What? Thanks. 
everything. Just dishes. Where's Mitch? What? I shouldn't say anything. Tell me. I just don't want you to be mad at her, Stan. She just hasn't been herself these days. I found the kids in the car. Would you let them there? In the garage. With the engine running. Uh, there, there is one person uh, I really want to thank, and uh, that's Gil, my sponsor. Kept me coming to my meetings, kept me working my steps, kept my paycheck too. <laughs> so Gil's been doling out what I need from week to week, and the rest is in the safekeeping. So better be man or I'm coming for you. <laughs> Six months clean. The one person who uh, should be here tonight isn't. It's Liz, my sister. She, uh, she raised me. Uh, sacrificed to you for me. So what did this rock bottom junkie do to pay her back? Lied to her. Cheated her. Stole from her. This one night, I, uh, I tweaked out of my head. Uh, I broke into her house. And uh, my nephew Davey, he's, he's seven years old. He's got this gold coin. He's real proud of it. I know that because he showed it to me. He was saving up all summer to get this thing. And uh, I go into his room. in his room and I take it I'm walking out and I look down and he's awake looking at me he's just staring at me and then I walk out I don't expect forgiveness. Uh, I know that if, if, it, if it comes or not, it's, it's none of my business. All I know is that the only thing that matters is what I do to earn it. That's all I got. Yeah, Lyndon. This is Jack Lyndon's mother. Yes, what is it? Is he okay? He sent my son those horrible photographs. Like it was some kind of joke to him. What photographs are you talking about? That dead girl, the one who's in the news. Your son emailed them to all his friends, Mrs. Lyndon. I'm trying really hard to be understanding here, but how could you let this thing happen? I didn't know.
I think about it every day. About the life I took away because of my selfishness. I wonder if I can ever be forgiven. I believe it is, in fact, against our nature to forgive, to let go of our anger. It is a conscious choice, one that seems almost impossible to ask of you. Those who loved Lily Richmond most Maybe it is impossible. But if you can, please forgive me. Related incidents is believed to have been triggered by a recent FBI raid on a Rainier Valley mosque. Sources also say the lead suspect in the Rosie Larson case may have ties to that mosque as well. These events, along with incidents of vandalism, have made many residents of the Rainier Valley afraid to leave their homes. Keep it here for the very latest on this breaking. Great. Now we're gonna have to hold this Molly's hands to get him to the polls. Mm. As if they know it all. Where the hell is he? We've got to get this Adam story out now. Darren's not gonna go for it. Because you know him so well. Yes, I do. And you know he's weak, Gwen. And you know he's going to lose this thing because of it. <sighs> of course, if he says no, lots of other ways the story could get to the press. You do that? I'll make sure everyone knows. No campaign will have you, except maybe in the secretarial booth. Darren, where have you been? I don't know if you've been watching the news, but it's, it's not good. Release it to the press. What? Release the story on Adams, now. Figures. You only care about other people's families. I've had about enough of your smart-ass remarks. Yeah, well, why don't you just send me to live with Dad? <laughs> your dad left ten years ago, so... That's probably not gonna happen. I'm all you got. I'm one of Rosie's shirts. They're gonna arrest the teacher soon. Where have you been? At work. Thinking. This is a good story. Mitch. Focus on the future, Mitch. The future. It's been a week 
I know what happened this morning. The boys could have been... We have responsibilities, Mitch. I'm not the one taking responsibility. You let her stay home that weekend. And if you weren't so strict, maybe she wouldn't have hid things from us. to Channel 3, which indicate that the mayor was paying upwards of $1,500 a month for an apartment housing his alleged mistress, a Janelle Stevens, a former intern in the Adams administration. You have no right to be here. Hey, Lennon. What's the little man? Uh, nothing. What, what are you doing here? Sweet you. What, you, you living here now? For a little while, yeah. I put a tap on Bennett's phone. I got the inspiration from the feds. Set up an emergency wiretap with the phone company. We get something. Get a judge to sign it off and make it admissible. I had to do something while you were shutting me out. And that's all arranged, I'm guessing? Yeah. Judge Elliot, I know I'm back from my narco days. Me and him are like, it's not gonna be a problem. Okay. Till then, we don't need to tell Oaks. I know. So, um, is there something, uh, is there something you want to ask me? Not anymore, no. Good. Because what you see is what you get. Yeah. I should have known subtlety isn't exactly your strong suit. <laughs> <laughs> no, maybe not. <laughs> So what do you say? You wanna be my day tonight? Sit on the wire? Yeah, why not? He'd rather be with Reggie anyways. I'll drive. The passports will be arriving tomorrow. Call me when they do, and this will all be over. Don't worry about the police, they don't know anything. 